Hi everyone, this is Coins Kid. Hope you're well. Uh, thank you for everything you're doing to contribute towards the growth of this channel. The comments, the likes, shares, obviously your subscription. Thank you very much. We've got some really fantastic comments across this channel. It's helping people and just a level of reinsurance as well. And I suppose a level of support as well. So it's, it's, it's all good. Thank you very much. So just marching on then, we're going to look at BitTorrent, okay? The BitTorrent token there, BTT. And you can see it's had that nice, lovely bounce off that 55 EMA there, and it's marched on. It's It's gone up, and it's back testing the 20 EMA here, and it's got a nice little curl on it now, and it's starting to look like it's creeping upwards. You see that? You're coming back down, and you're back testing that beautifully on the four hourly time frame here. So it looks good. It looks good because I'm, I've seen a lot of projects that have actually got the back test off this 55 through that Bitcoin correction, obviously, and then it's marched on, but they've actually fallen through this 20. At the moment, BTT is holding it really, really well. So effectively, you could be looking at that impulsive move coming a little bit quicker than most because you can see how strong uh, BitTorrent is here. It's hugging this yellow line, okay? It's not really fell below. That was your bear, bear market just there. That was not necessarily a bear market, but it was very bear, bear. It was a bit of a downtrend there where it did fall through and it was under and it couldn't get back above. But since it's got back above, you can see it's consistently been above this yellow line, okay, until this correction just there where it did fall down bounced off the red line which is the 55 EMA okay shown really really strong support what a buy area that was okay from that collapse there this is what I say to you when you see it going over extended like that that's going vertical do you see that vertical and this line going vertical always an indicator of you know jump ship get out take your profits where you can not financial advice because you will see that rollover okay it's normal look at the RSI up there at level 91 okay the rsi is saying i'm going to roll over i'm, I'm overbought it i'm running out of steam okay massive signal massive signal you know and you can see yourself common sense look it's vertical vertical okay it's a really really big signal to sort of say well, I'm, I'm gonna i need to take some profits here because right now if you'd have took profits up there okay you, you would be looking at uh buying back in 40 44 percent cheaper or accumulating 44 more percent more uh btt for the next leg up which is that leg there which is a zero zero one seven and, and from this point right now okay you're looking at a, a whopping from the bottom there when it tested the ma because it's what i always say to people not financial advice sell the highs buy the lows and the buy the lows are the retest of the ema that hold support when you're holding emas that hold support boom it's, it's confluence for the fact that you, you're going to start marching on and start going up to make them new impulsive waves and them new highs so from that ema there you're looking at 132 percent appreciation for btt so it's, it's looking really strong it's looking really good okay so from this level here if this can hold you are looking at a 85 uh, percent trade for for btt and there's no reason to 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 think that it won't hold at the moment you've gone up you've had these lovely little candles here okay you're getting a little bit of selling pressure that's dropped in but you are getting supported off this 50 uh, this 20 ma now at the, on the daily time frame what you may start to get though there from a structure of that you know it may start to go sideways a little bit and that, that would not be unhealthy okay because you can see what happens when you go up you make a high you come back down you hit the the, the, the daily there the 20 you go up you made a fa fail to make a secondary high there you see that so you start to roll over and then you just start to go sideways a bit crap bit boring bit monogamous but then you do sort of refuel the rocket ship supposed so to speak get the rsi in the mid level there just like it is there look see how lovely that rsi looks now because look it was all the way up there all the way up there massively oversold signal saying i'm going to roll over what you do you wait for the rsi to come back down to the bottom there's so many indicators that you can use you can use the blow off top basically indicate just common sense looking at it saying it's going vertical i'm going to roll over i'm going to buy back down when it's touching these emas confirmation of support holding it go long again okay well you just use the rsi look so it's oversold right i'm, I'm jumping shit i'm gonna i'm gonna buy back when it comes back down to that lower level like here sell buy sell buy sell buy sort of thing you know what i mean so that's it that's basically rsi <laughs> trading it's so many people use different indicators entirely up to yourself what you want to use but uh, i just dropped the rsi in there just as confluence to, to the signals and stuff so it's all good but at the moment you are making progress you are marching on uh, towards that towards that uh, price target there you have got your support levels in here okay and you can see that was a support level but what you what you've got now you've got this 55 ema which is actually creeping up so that's actually going to act as a really strong support level failing that okay failing that if you was to fall through here then you may see a bounce off the 55 and if you do lose the 55 that's super super strong super super strong 
okay i can't anticipate i don't anticipate you falling any lower than that because if you do you'll start making a bearish cross on a four hourly time frame here it'll start rolling over and then i would like i said to you in yesterday's video target the previous swing highs as support come onto your charts target the previous swing highs as support but i would anticipate you know if it was to roll over not financial advice that that particular level right there would be an amazing buy area even a retest of the 55 would be amazing buy area you know you're looking at 116 percent to that high from this bottom here you're looking at a whopping 130 percent appreciation to that high so you know let's hope that it does come down but for those that are not involved fantastic buy areas but again you are showing signs of a new impulsive wave here you're going up obviously you're going to hit resistance back to support so we'll just drop the fib on it again okay and see where we are with this so that's your base and that's your bottom just like that okay so that's what it is you've got you and you're retracing now from there so that's your bottom what we'll do we'll drop the extension on it as well and i think that will tie up with our our um because it's a 141 isn't it yeah that's right because it's a 141 because we fell through the emas there so it's harder to get back up to there so that's all it's all good it's all golden so at the minute you can see what it's done is, is it started to retrace you're in the 050 and i've said to you that's a really rock solid level to get through okay as you start to retrace at the all-time high there or any local high you, you do hit your head on that and I, I think i said to you yesterday you're potentially looking to hit your head on that level there you're coming back down you, you're falling through this support of the 0382 now so potentially you know if you if you fail to get back above this 0382 you will start to hit a little, a little bit more pressure and you will start to roll over and potentially come down and hit this 032 so again you know these are all tradable events because these will be really good little buy zones if it break down you buy you go and you know it's going to pump up to the next level and it is said so you've got a little intro eight percent trade there so you you go long and take profit okay and then when it hits that potentially it come back down so you go short and take profit and it, it just gets caught sideways like that okay like that just like it did here sideways boring rubbish consolidation before moving on and and, and then making that new high so what we'll do we'll look at this particular consolidation event here you can measure that okay so you measure from the high there till it went up and it started to breach that high it took 10 days we're looking at a very similar uh, consolidation event for um to be fair so you're looking at 10 days so we'll mark that on the on the on the chart here so 10 days 10 days roughly around there okay so roughly there press alt v on your keyboard and it gives you a vertical line so we're anticipating it getting up to its high by that time okay so again all you do the second column down you go down and you've got vertical line you've got vertical line you just click it and then you can move that to move it wherever you want to move it okay so that's basically it really for btt sort of consolidation it's it's looking healthy it's retracing well you are hitting levels of resistance which is expected you know falling back onto levels of support so basically btt good luck to anybody involved with that um do stay tuned i will try and keep you updated on btt i've obviously got so many projects that i'm covering in this channel now the channel's becoming a little bit bloated with particular projects. I might just try and squeeze a couple of them into into sort of one video. Uh, do take care, everyone. Stay safe, stay strong, and stay tuned. And I'll be back tomorrow with an update on BTT. Take care. Bye bye.